What's up you guys? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to Nesfab. Welcome back to some more NFT. So, in today's video, we're gonna be slapping on some headlights on NFT. So when I picked up this car from Dave, uh, he had this thing set up for like Street 32 class, which is like a DSM class, and uh, no headlights are required. But there are a couple classes that I may potentially run in in the future that are gonna require headlights. And plus, when we're doing testing at nighttime, at the Pueblo track, it is dark AF on the turnoff uh, at the bot at the end of the track. Uh, luckily, I've been able to drive it during the day, so I kind of know how it is. But in this car at night with no headlights, it's a little sketchy. It's almost like pitch black. So, and also too, they you know kind of got on me a little bit about not having headlights. They like to have you, they like for you to have tail lights because that way they can see your car at the end of the track and they know that you're clear and you know they're good to send the next pair down. So I had tail lights, but I just never really got headlights wired up. Uh, and for one is because the, the headlights are missing, the oil catch can is kind of in the way, and these are just kind of like, these are like blanks. These are actually supposed to be like headlight covers for them. Uh, Carbonetics, Sergio makes a pretty cool set. If you guys are big DSMers, you guys know Carbonetics, which he makes carbon for a lot of other vehicles, not just DSMs. But uh, he makes some nice headlight leads. But uh, we'll get those on the next chassis when we do the three-piece front end on the GSX. And you know, like I said, right now, trial and error with the car. So, but anyways, I picked these up off of Amazon and we're gonna like, I already got one kind of step back there, which they're gonna be clean. We're gonna stick them behind here. I gotta make a little, it's hopefully I should just be able to do just a straight bar, just to mount them. Uh, the fabrication to mount these is gonna be pretty quick and easy. It's just the wiring is gonna be kind of a pain in the butt. So I want to make a wire harness to go from both headlights. Uh, I'm probably gonna run it along with the other wiring down into the inside and all this wired into the same switch that the tail lights are wired on. I already have a switch for those, so obviously. It'll just almost be like a normal car. Flip on the headlights, tail lights, and we're good to go. So I'm gonna slap on the Nez, the Nez chest cam. Yeah, the Nez chest cam and uh, you have a long ride for the journey. Some more fab work, some more stuff going on here at, uh, at NESFAB. You know what time it is, it's GSD. Batteries died. Get you guys an update. <clears throat> All right, so we got we got these mounted. You guys saw that before. They, I think the camera died. Okay, we got this loomed up. Just we got this zip tied here. Yes, I'm gonna cut these down. Wires zip tied. So we got kind of the the light side of the harness done. So I just got done stringing this out. If there's a faster way to put loom on some wire, somebody let me know. I have yet to kind of Google it. So I feel like there may be a quicker way, but Man, trying to loom like eight feet, nine feet of wire takes a little bit. But we got this all loomed, so that way we don't have to pull it through the car once. I'm gonna route it up. I gotta pull this inner fender well out. And that's where the wire's gonna run, dip in the car. And then I just gotta, I just did it a little bit longer so that way I can cut it to length. Uh, and then 
buck connector and do all the connectors inside for the switch. And then we should be good. Flip that switch and hopefully the lights turn on. So uh, not too much longer, too much longer. So you guys know what's up, let's get it done. All right, moment of truth. Let's flip the battery on. Let's flip the switch on. I just got done wiring. Let's see. Switch on. Ooh, snap. I see all the reflection of the trailer. Yeah, there we go. Got some little beams. Little beamers. Right on. Cool. Lights work, you guys. So, now we're going to be able to see once we're making rips down the pass, or down the pass, making rips down the track and turning off. And now, like I said, this there's like a lot of rules and a lot of classes require you to have like headlights. And I was like, damn it, man, I don't have headlights. But now we got headlights. So that opens up the door for a lot of other races. I mean, this was a simple thing. I picked up these little lights. They're like 20 bucks on Amazon. So I mean, they, don't, they ain't gotta be crazy bright, but you have to have some headlights, so. All right, we're one step closer to getting this thing tested. Uh, the axles did show up from uh, uh, my buddy Jib Jab got those over, so I got to slap one axle in. But uh, besides that, we got to wrap up the car, and it's good for testing. But that's going to do it for this video. Quick little headlight wiring on the race car. Simple, easy, a couple dirt connectors, and uh, we're good to go. So uh, make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, and get your butts out there and get shit done. GSD, baby.